Welcome back, South Africa. We now cross over to our international correspondent, David Kibuka, who is in Greece. Dave, how is it there? This place leaves a lot to be desired, Loy. What are you doing? As I've been saying over the last few weeks, the European Union is falling apart because the countries are broke and the situation is getting ugly as Christmas approaches because there's no money for presents or turkey. But what caused it? Various things, but the main thing is they let the Greeks join the EU. It's like if Southern Africa formed a union with a common currency, then we allowed Zimbabwe to join. Everyone would be eating, but when the bill, game, bill came, the Zimbabweans would go to the bathroom and to try climb out of the window. Greeks are the Zimbabweans of Europe, Lord. So, so can we kiss the European Union goodbye, Dave? Well, they're trying their best not to let it dissolve, but the Zimbabweans, I mean the Greeks, are not cooperating. The French and Germans offered the Greeks money, but in true Mugabe style, the Greeks looked a gift horse in the mouth and said they need some time to think about it. Dave, what would be the consequence of the Eurozone falling apart? Firstly, it would be control alt delete for Greece, then Europe. There would be lots of poor white people, and you know that white people aren't used to being poor. They have no poor people etiquette. Like when you see a black beggar at the traffic light, they often have swag asking you for cigarettes and if you're going to finish that cold drink. But white beggars always seem traumatized while holding those, bo those boards with the incorrect spelling. I mean, they don't even smile, Loy. It's like they're thinking, I can't believe I'm poor. I can't believe I'm poor. This is just a bad dream. Tomorrow I'm going to wake up, smell good, and South Africa will have a white president again. What, what, what's poor person uh, etiquette, Dave? Come on. Like, just because you're poor doesn't mean you should stop wearing lotion. You're standing outside the whole day, so you need to take care of your skin. Some of these people are 30, but look 50. But, Dave, they have no money for lotion. But they have plenty of money for booze. Maybe they should have one less clippies and coke and buy a bit of lotion. Dave, you know that's classes, right? Classes, masters. What? I'm not talking about class. I'm saying hang back on the booze and get some lotion. And also, I want to ask poor white folks what they were doing during apartheid. Were they poor then as well? If you are white and poor during apartheid and are poor now during the time of the comrades, maybe you were meant to be poor. <laughs> Dave, I, I thought we were supposed to be talking about Greece. I've never been to Greece. But where are you now? Thanks, Lord. Dave, Dave, Dave is crazy.